Hello friends, welcome to my channel Rex Rahul. In today's video, we will learn about how to customize the bash prompt. So what if uh, uh, I don't want this uh, uh, default prompt, if I want to change this default uh, prompt to uh, something else, maybe, uh, maybe I want uh, this host name to be changed to something else, maybe my custom uh, string and if i also want to change the color of this whole whole prompt so how we can do that so in today's video we will learn about this so let's get started the whole information of this prompt is stored in the ps1 variable so if you try to print ps1 variable it will give you a long string so this is the string which is passed by the bash parser and the result is this prompt. So here you can see username at the rate host name which is coming from slash backslash u and backslash h. So backslash h is for host name and backslash u is for username. There is some of the other part of a string representing the color coding and uh, this backslash w is for current working directory so what if we want to change it to rex rahul so if we assign rex rahul to this simple string to ps1 it will change the prompt as this we have noticed here that rex rahul is not separated by one space with the command so there must be some separation so what you can do is to add one space also here so you can see now space is entered now we also want to display this dollar so you can also write this same like it like this and put some space now the default uh, one was having green color so to give it a color you just you will have to copy this string part and just paste it rex rahul and till dollar will be colored by using this color configuration so what if we press enter it displays the prompt as in green color so what if we want to change there are some values for the colors if you want to change let's say it to red so 31 is for red so we will get the red color prompt and you will also notice that whatever the command we enter it is displayed in red color but we don't want command to be red so what we will do you just have to copy this and 00, zero is for the white color so we will tell that this part of the string should be applied with this color coding and this color coding will be applied whatever the next to it so we will close it here and put some space and enter so now you can see anything you type here any command will be in white color so you can see that we can change or customize our prompt or bash prompt using this ps1 variable but it will not work if you just exit the terminal and restart it so all the color coding and all your customization has gone so to make a default customized bash prompt you will have to save the configuration in a file so the file here is dot bash rc in your home directory so you will have to navigate to your home directory and just search for bash rc file and edit it 
so this is the bash rc file so in this file you will have to search for the variable ps1 here this whole configuration is saved so you will have to make changes here so let's say we don't want this default prompt we will comment it and we will make new so just copy it So you have to just change if you don't want to display the host name you just need here Rex Rahul okay and after that you want to display like this and we want it in red color and you save it so we have saved our changes so now we will source the bash rc to apply our changes so you can see prompt is now changed to red color and our customized string so now if you re you will restart the terminal or oh, let's say we will exit from here and start again so you can see the changed prompt is there so that's all friends hope you like my video if you like my video please subscribe to my channel rex rahul mm -hmm.